New information, a law enforcement official says the gunman who killed 12 people at a California bar posted to social media during that attack. The gunman, Ian David Long, posted about his mental state on Facebook, saying, quote, I hope people call me insane. Wouldn't that just be a big ball of irony? Yeah, I'm insane, but the only thing you people do after these shootings is hopes and prayers or keep you in my thoughts every time and wonder why these keep happening. Authorities have yet to determine a motive. We're hoping to find information that will help us identify what the motive was for this sick, sick, depraved individual. The officer said that investigators are looking at several possibilities, including whether or not the gunman believed his ex-girlfriend would be at that bar. We wanted to know if the mass shooting at that local bar at... Uh... In California, has local bar owners rethinking security as we head into the weekend? Way 31 Sierra Phillips is at Furniture Factory where customers will notice extra security. Sierra? Now, right now, Furniture Factory is calm, but pretty soon, as the night crowd heats up, and more people come, the security will also increase. And pretty soon, that security team will also include Huntsville police officers. It's a scary situation. When I came home the other night, I popped the TV on about 1.30 in the morning, and, and there it was on the news. Mark Camara owns four bars here in Huntsville. He told me when he saw a gunman open fire at a Southern California bar, he was worried about his own patron's safety. I said, man, I'm in the same situation, kind of. Not that I have any problems here at all. I don't. That's why he says he reached out to Huntsville police to help keep his bar safe. By having officers work security. People will feel safer, I'm sure, and go from there. Kamara says he's always had security here at the bar, but after the 2016 Pulse nightclub shooting in Orlando, he increased measures. I've kind of made aware with my help things I think to look for, and especially the doorman. And Kamara says he's working to add more security at his other locations. But you just never know. Now, the owner told me today Huntsville police are planned to be here working security next Thursday, but he's already talked to his security team about remaining vigilant and making sure they look out for things that seem out of place. Reporting live in Huntsville, Sierra Phillips, Way 31 News.